our life. Yo, the Lord is going to give us prosperity. That's right. So if you don't fight for this thing, they're going to root you out that earth. Read. And at that time, therefore, the decree said, Whosoever shall come to make a pact with us on the Sabbath day, we will fight against him. So, any boy, so we ought to fight the Sabbath and they want to fight. We're willing to fight, man. That's all right. Don't think we are going to sit down and fight. We are going to punch. We are going to kick. We are going to box. Right? Read. Neither will we die hard as our brethren that were murdered in the secret place. Because the news of the Sabbath day, we the Israelites are going to rest. So uh, they come and they murder the brethren there. But we're not going to do like them. We are going to stand up and we are going to fight the battle. That's right. Right? And the Lord is going to pray for prevail, man. Right? Then came here unto him a company of Assyrians who were mighty men of Israel, even all such as were voluntary, devoted unto the law. We devoted unto our law, statute and commandment. And that's why we come out here and we come from bring forth the words and we ever the Father. Because what? He ordained us to do with job, man. And we are doing the job and we are not doing it with fear. We are right. doing it with what? The Lord does give us the spirit of fear. The Lord give us power. The Lord give us might. And that's how we judge so. Right? We don't come back, stand up with food, have hope our face, have music that we hear, and I want to attend to the Lord here. Nah, we attend to the Lord here. We live right. out and we comfort to so. We come praise the Lord. God right. Lord said wisdom right out in the street. Right. How we know the street? That's right. So we must be the man of the Lord. Right. First Maccabees 3 and 21. But we fight for our lives and our lords. Uh -huh. we Wherefore the Lord said, the Lord himself will overthrow them before our face. The Lord will overthrow all these nations. In front of our fears. All we need to do, come and fight for the Lord of our power. In truth and sincerity. Our fear, man. The Lord has overthrow the whole nation in front of us. But no one no believe. Because we're the carnal. Right? We're the carnal. We don't want to stand up for the Father. But we, we don't stand up for the Father. All right, me, I feel the foot them. I hurt me. Me, I punish the flesh. Because the spirit must be in control. Right? Because this flesh, it seeks all kind of things, man. But what? We said, this flesh of God and in pressure. We have pressure on the flesh. And make the spirit stay in control. And as for you, be ye not afraid of them. What, sir? And as for you, you be ye not, not afraid, afraid of them. Not here, we come out down for the boy again. Not here. Because the Lord said, as for me, be not afraid of them. And when we read them as scripture, it charged me up. He oh, said, charged me up. That's right. Read. Now as soon as he left, for as soon as he left off speaking, he left suddenly upon them. And so, Siron. That's it, that's it. That's right. And that's why we come out here and say Israelites and repent. 
Come back to the heavenly father way. That's right. Don't be blasted at your commandment. Hey, look how we out up on the road. And no found the free. What are you afraid for? Eh? What are you afraid for? What are you afraid of the self? How are you self for the fear of the man? Because no nation can't touch us. What am I saying? No nation can't touch us. That's right. Right. Because we are the man of the Lord. That's right. Can. And everything we're written in the book written for our learning. Gee. Right, we just read back a bit and him say, yo, I wouldn't pray that man. I pray that not man. I pray that you are my shimmy time. Right, right. right. I am at the ultimate power. Right? And we are serving. Yo, preaching. Bye bye. And good. Yeah man, the boat man. Why are you both dumb? You're blessed? Oh, you're blessed, kid. You're just blessed. You like the word blessed. You like the word blessed. I'm going to show you a little bit. In Revelation. Revelation 22. I'll show you how you're blessed, yeah? Because this word is just said. Bless! <laughs> Revelation 22 and 14. Bless the day that do his commandments. I saw you have a blessed, my brother. You have to do the commandments for his father. Because we you know you're a Benjamin. You hear that? You're a Benjamin. And the Lord says, Bless our day that you will You are part of the 12th tribe of Israel. Right. Where you have a blessing, you have to be a commandment. You have to be a commandment here. Alright. We have 630. Are you saying? I'm one. And grow your beard. You understand? Because. Eh? Right. You know what is sin, my brother? You know what is sin? Sin. Sin. Wow. That's good, man. You see? Transgression of the law. That's right. Sir Frederick, you hear about the Hebrew Israelite? Sorry? You hear about the Hebrew Israelite? We hear them. So we had about it. Eh? So you know, you know, you know, come home back here, everything. Each man to their own order. Each man to their own order. Hey, hey, hey. You know, we ain't getting you know, no one there. Romans chapter 8 verse 16 The Spirit is 
itself bears witness with our spirit that we are the children of the Most High. So we are going to read some, some scripture to you. And if you be a witness with them, you could have been amongst us. You understand? Because at the end of the day, man, we're not going to put away our brother, man. Uh, give me James. Uh, give me James, James one, yeah. One hour. One hour. So we got it's a child and spirit. This is Romans chapter 8, verse 16. The spirit itself bears witness in our spirit that we are the children of the most high. And if the children then heirs, heirs of the most high and joint heirs with the Mashiach. So you see, when it's a ears. There's things that we hear unto us, right? Because you believe not the Father, 100%. Give me John 10, verse 27. Give me John 10, verse 27.
but it shall come to pass thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God observe and to do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day so the Lord said this shall happen if you do not listen to the commandment on the command of this day read that all his curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee so curse the bow people and overtake them read curse shall thou be in the city the Lord said curse shall we be in the cities when we know the cities who are the last fire? First fire. The so-called black man and black woman. When ten things are about them say, Oh Pam, you have to go, you know, you was a good worker. But you know, everything is coming on the downside. <laughs> so you have to go, Pam. Really? Right? Eat. Eat. And then when it's talk about by our side, them say chef, you have to go because we are the last fire, first fire. Curse shall thou be in the field. When the tobacco field, the cane field. See that now? How we in the field, you know? yes, We take up curse. Yes. So the Lord put us in the what? Tobacco field, cane field. That's right. Cotton field. That's right. So the Lord, we was in the tobacco field, cane field. We not a tobacco factory. We not have sugar, milk. We don't have no textile store where we people have a big cotton. But we people have us in these fields. So we have two of our money where we get, where, where, where these fields generate. We don't get nothing. They said they go give us a horse, a mule, or what? A yaka and a mule. You get no yaka? You get no yaka? You get mule? Why then? But they said they go give it. We take up curse, read. Curse shall be thy basket. And my store. Look around. Who have the store them? Our people have the store? Whether well, we have one barber shop? And why they give a barber shop? Because when you trim your beard and you shave off your head, you're under a curse. Because ah. that is an extra question of the law. So they say, yes, make them have a barber shop. They shall go and defile themselves. Right? And we have a look here shop. Both well, people them start with that kind of sin set in here in the men. That's right. And when they put them sitting in the men, for them want them want proper hair start jump off of their head. Because when them sweat, the sins that take here start mash up them scalp. Right? Curse shall be thy, the fruit of thy body. So they said, curse shall be the fruit of your body. The fruit of your body, our mother. Children. So when the children them come, the children them start to work. Serve the will of Adam, God. They're not serving. Wow. If sister, that's right, sister. God, that to take up our people and not know. They must serve the will of the Eden. That's and right. When we serve the will of the Eden, what happened to us? Give me the book of Proverbs 3, verse 21. Sister, so something good, man. And at them sister who are around them. We have knowledge I lad. And some are turned for your men, as turned for those who come from to another world. Right. Right. Oh. So bad. right, right. You know you're Israelite? Yes. The pastor tell him. We know the text, but we can't read the text. Right. right, but you know you can't read the text, but team job. You supposed to open the pulpit and tell yourself, yes. you are the best people that ever want to face on the earth. Oh. But why not tell you that? Because what? They're not collect money. And when they collect money, if you talk that, the ugly red people are not going to come back in that church, right? They won't soon know. Because they might devil like the Bible speaker. God, they've deceived the whole earth, man. That's right. They've deceived the whole earth, and I tell you, say, I'm black woman. Yeah, he's all right. And you are the prince. You are the prince and the, the princess and the power. Right? So we have to come back to our heritage. That's right, my brother. That, that's right. Right, read that. Proverbs 3, 31. Envy thou not the oppressor and choose none of his ways. So we now choose none of the oppressor here. We say, let me walk around with dog. If you want a dog to walk with, if you don't want a dog in my house. Right? Because at the end of the day, man, yo, dog shed here, you know. So everywhere in your house, you put all your clothes, you have dog here for you. You go in your bed, dog here in your bed. Yes, but you know what I'm doing? 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 You know what I'm do
thing you walk, you smell like dog. Yeah, you tell it to Right. Because they're my dog, and that's why they love dog. Right? Only a dog love a dog. Please, Right? Go back to that first one. Go to arm, you turn on the 28 and start at arm. Go 16 now. That's 17, it's like that. No, jump at 13, 34. Yeah. Deuteronomy 28, verse 32. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. So we sons and daughters are given unto another people. Why are we giving unto another people? You know this? The sons and daughters are given unto another people. Right, so the Father give us to another people. Right. That's right. Read. And thine eyes shall look and felt longing for them all the day long. So we look and we see the son and the daughter are given unto another people. And see me, I look. We can't even open my mouth. Because if we open my mouth, they would have to take off my head. Right? So the Lord said, this is a curse that come upon us. The sons of the shall give it to another people. And they will be looking, longing to see them. And we will never see them come back. When we see them, they pass here. Yeah, we will not even know them. Because they grow to sight. And then remember you neither. Because what? As we say, they grow to sight. And there shall be no might in thy hand. No might in our hand to take them back. Because what? As sister said, we pray the commandment. That's right. Right? Jump to part here. Let me show sure sister this. Deuteronomy 28, verse 8. Therefore shalt thou serve thy enemies, which the Lord shall send against thee. You see, and the Lord send them against us. We shall serve our enemy, which the Lord sent against us. So now we sit down and we have been laughing. We're laughing with them. We have been tea with them. I we feel like them. Oh, I got my best friend. What we say, why are your best friend? Let me look. The holy red boy. And them best friend now. We check some of look. Never see my people. I'm my people for them best friend. We are in hunger. And in thirst, and in nakedness, so and in want of all things. It's in hunger. We don't plant no food. Anything we want, we have to go into them store for buy. And that's why they must sell us defiled food. Right now, they have chicken in our place. We are the real chicken. If you go in a Burger King, are you go in a McDonald's, are you go to KFC, all of those chicken and all of those food are not real food. They manufacture them. That's right. And who got in there? The people. Right. Because they inject them. Exactly. Right, right. Exactly. But sister, the thing is this though. We are living under a curse and we have to break the curse. And the only way we break the curse, we have to go back home to Dada. Because he married unto us. And because he married unto us. So much require of us and give us all. So we are Israelites. Do you stand up? So he give us so we are Israelites. So all we give us to us, he require things from us. Did he require us to change and come back? You know it's work. You know it's work. No. Lobster. No, no, they want to be Right, right, right. I'm very the time. These things, we forget what? High blood pressure, yeah. high cholesterol, cancer, all sickness. Yes. Because the Lord said, I do Deuteronomy. Give me Deuteronomy 64. Give me 64. Yes, so we people, we see 
can't move. Well, I make ramp up. Right? Them have all kind of sickness. And the Lord will kill them, sister. Because they're not doing it. They're not doing nothing to please your father. So the Lord, just read that again. He said, read the last part. Deuteronomy 28 and verse 61. Also, every sickness and every plague which is not written in the book of his law, them will the Lord bring up on thee until thou be destroyed. Until we're dead off. Read the precept. This is 2nd Edris, chapter 7, verse 21. Yahweh have given them straight commandment to such as came what they should do to live even as they came and what they should observe to avoid punishment. So you see, the Lord give us straight commandment, what we should do to live and what we should do to avoid punishment but we don't do it, some punishment coming our way. Nevertheless, they were not obedient unto him, but spake against him. Imagine, the Lord said, all these things here for us to live and survive. But we decide that we don't agree. So all kind of calamity come upon us, man. Right? And deceived themselves by their wicked deeds and said of the Most High that he is not. Hey, sister, you want one? You want one? And knew not his ways. And when you we do not the Lord ways, man, right? We never come and do commandment in truth and sincerity, man. Right. For his law have they despised and denied his covenants in his statutes, have they not been faithful and have not performed his works. We despise the heavenly father last statue, and we do not stand up and do his commandment. We walk away from this great way of life. We walk away from our heritage, but we're not disobedient. We are the children who have come and serve the Heavenly Father in truth and sincerity. So brothers and sisters, I try to join hand and come do Father work continually. Because yo, we're there man to set the way for the younger generation. So the younger generation can stop polluting themselves in this wicked way That's right. of life and come back home to righteousness. Right? Because yo, we brothers, we are striving for righteousness, man. Right? We get the Bible, man. We read, man. We read the scripture. Because it was written for our learning. Right? Not wrong and ever written for us to come and do. Everything written wrong and for we demise. Not the road of the answers. It's all in the scripture. Written for the answers. Everything else, we try everything before and not know what. We try dance all in a walk. We keep them, police come, carry them, we brother them, kill each other in them. And a few we have like that. From we take up the Bible and we are doing the work of our Father. None of us have lag ahead with each other. None of us have lag ahead with each other. If a man no come back here, we have a scholar man and say, Virgil, brother, have one man, we in the dark here. We not got crucified because what? I brother, I want the Lord some man. Let brother the love continue man. Right? Give me um Leviticus 17, 19. Yeah, read that, read that. And therefore, address with the empty are empty things, and for the full are the full things. So for the empty are empty things, man. I for the fool are fool things, man. Right? Leviticus 19. 17 and 19. Leviticus 19 and 17. Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thine heart. What did that say? Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thy heart. We can't come out here and eat our brother in our heart. When it's an eat your brother in your heart, we can't eat your brother in our mind. We can't suffer. Not for our brother. If we see our brother go wrong, we have to talk to him. And if you talk to him, and you talk to him, and he's not here, make him go on. But try. Don't just let him lose like that. Try with him. Right. Have a question? You can ask him. Have a question? Okay. We have to try with our brother, man. Right? Read. Thou 
shall in any wise rebuke thy neighbor uh -huh. and 